Good evening and thanks for joining us. It is always a clear and present danger while working outdoors in remote parts of this country. But what happened to an oil worker in Alberta still comes as a shock. She was killed by a black bear. It happened at a Suncor oil sand site north of Fort McMurray, not at night, but in the middle of the afternoon. And while her horrified co-workers tried desperately to stop it, Francis Silvaggio has our story tonight. It's a cruel twist of irony in the heart of Alberta's oil sands, an industry often described as an assault on nature. Nature has bit back with deadly force. Well, yesterday, approximately uh, 2 15 in the afternoon, our uh, detachment received a call from Suncor advising that uh, an employee had been attacked by a black bear. Friends and co workers have identified the victim as Lorna Weefer. By the time RCMP arrived, she was dead and the bear was subsequently shot. Suncor officials say employees are shocked. This tragedy is, is unprecedented. We, I've never seen anything like this in, in my history with the company and it, it is absolutely devastating. Despite the almost constant buzz of activity at Suncor's base plant, bear sightings are routine. Attacks though are extremely rare. Experts say black bears account for just a couple deaths each year and when they do, it's almost always because they're hungry. In these predaceous incidents, that's how they behave. They are so focused. They'll ignore other people. They'll ignore, they'll ignore even being shot at and even injured. RCMP say Weeper's co-workers tried to scare off the bear but were unsuccessful. Occupational Health and Safety is now investigating to see if more could have been done. Um, that uh, all workers, whether it's at this site or any other, are well trained uh, to know how to conduct themselves and how to handle these situations uh, should they occur. Suncor says warning signs are posted throughout the site and all employees are required to take bear awareness training. Bear safety awareness training includes understanding what the hazard is, knowing how to limit interactions with bears and other wildlife, and also the effective deployment and use of bear deterrence. The details of this attack remain under investigation. Fish and Wildlife is now on site setting up bear traps and providing additional surveillance. The company says this has never happened before and wants to make sure it never happens again. Francis Silvaggio, Global News, Calgary.